well hello there and welcome to another training video in this nugget i'll be showing you on how to create new columns in odoo crm let's get started when i log in into my odoo crm module and you'll notice that the view on my projects is based on the kanban more of column based so if you see the first column is known as new the second column is known as qualified. The third is prospect, one, and those are just the columns I already have in my lead generation pipeline. So if I would want to add another column that will hold information, for example, after sales support, then the easiest approach is to navigate to the right section and you'll notice an option for stage so i'll click on that option for stage and it will allow me to type the name of the new stage i'll call it after sales and then i'll click on add now what happens is when this after sales has been added there is a setting option for that specific column if i click on that setting option I have the fold option, edit stage option, and delete option. If I navigate to edit stage option, there are a number of settings I can put in just to make sure it flows alongside the way I want to manage my leads. I have two check options here. One is, is one stage and the other one is folder in pipeline. So is one stage if i activate that it means that whenever a lead moves to that specific column it is automatically marked as one and it means successful so that is what this is one stage means if i select folder in the pipeline it simply means a category a blank category that separates specific leads group to the next one so i don't want it to be my one stage because i already have a one stage and i don't want it to be a folder in the pipeline and i can also give a description around what this after sale column means for instance it's more into following it up if the client was happy with the product that we sold or the service that we sold and what qualifies a specific lead to get into this after sales column or option so once i feel these options are correct i just click on save and close now notice there is a horizontal scroll bar here can scroll to the right section and I can add as many stages that I would want so that my project is visible on a single dashboard. Well, that is how we set up columns in Odoo CRM. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next nugget.